Welcome back to Razmafsar TV. I'm uh, showing you here uh, Hayden Lewis, Razmafsar USA. So he's doing some boxing exercises, as then you can see, he's using uh, he's a southpaw. So being a southpaw, he's using his different techniques uh, to go ahead, and then a knee. Just one uh, tip when you do the knee, I also do it sometimes this way. Make sure that the toes uh, point to the ground. This is going to be a bit better and more sharp when you execute it. You see that Hayden has a tendency uh, to leave his uh, guard open from the, his the right side, meaning this could be an invitation for a jab. Then he could catch it and then counter with his uh, uh, left uh, hook or left cross. But that's a tendency he has. Uh, some boxing uh, coaches uh, mentioned that this is too open, but I mean, <clears throat> they also criticized uh, Muhammad Ali for having an open guard, but he just mastered uh, the boxing scene. He's one of the best boxers ever. So uh, he is now uh, moving again. You see that um, going uh, to, uh, not to an elbow, he does an elbow very well. Uh, and then now here it comes a shin kick. Shin kick is a very powerful one. You just uh, hit with the lower part of your shin and he does a side kick. Side kicks are very nice, come as an element of surprise. You cannot do it all the time because if you keep doing it, you are going to be countered. You're going to catch it and countered by a low kick as we all know. In Muay Thai, they do it all the time, in Kyukushin as well. But if you do it selectively, side, kick or side kicks are very, very good. And then he just, uh, he's now moving again. Different kicks, different uh, guards. Sometimes you do Ken Norton uh, guard, Hayden. <laughs> Interesting to watch. And then he does also brings in then uh, uppercuts as well, body shots as well. The versatility is the key in um, boxing, in kickboxing, in uh, any striking art. And he's uh, doing it as well. Now a high kick, very good. And he's moving to different uh, areas, gaining ground, stepping back. We call it in our language, losing ground, gaining ground and moving in. He gets the, uh, the angle very well. I really like the body shots and the uppercuts you do and he uh, keeps moving there as you can see it here now he continues here different um, um, and okay knee comes and then uh, low kick make your knee more dedicated uh, and then he goes with different punches and to different areas as you can see that okay now he goes down and just bring someone down and punch into the ground MMA style and now again bring someone down the same thing this is also very important practice if you do MMA you need to learn how to punch punch when you're on the ground or when you throw someone down because we just react the way we train that is it is very important to take this into consideration so he's uh, moving for uh, two different sides and then practicing it as you can see, he keeps moving and uh, this is very, very important. Aiden is um, going, getting the angles and boxing, straight punches and from time to time try to, you know, instead of stepping forward, slide forward a bit, just to have a variety in your move uh, Hayden so he's punching at different angles getting close and kicking as well and now he brings someone down again and as you can see he moves to different angles and he different punches just make sure okay this is a throw again Greco Roman style as you can see it here So he moves in and then punches to the ground. Now a kick. 
kick. This is a shin kick he preferably does. Outside uh, low kicks, you can do also from time to time. Uh, inner low kick means he shoot up. As you know, outside you just axe him down. Inner low kick, you shoot his leg up. You can also integrate it if you wish from time to time. So he's moving to different sides and he takes different angles as you can see it here. So Hayden is uh, uh, practicing more and now he go to the next round, he keeps his guard again, keeps moving elbow I like the way he does these elbows they come in a very strong manner very strong way this is really good now he's moving to different sides this is really good the way he moves and now this is a knee different knees and then again bringing someone down these are all very important moves I like the way you move your body and avoid punches from side to side. This is very good. This is very, very important. So he moves from side to side, bobbing, weaving, and they're all American hallmarks of boxing. Very good. And then he moves again to different sides and keeps moving. And this is important. A knee. Again, throwing and punching on the ground, as you can see it here. Kicks, front kicks, and then also punches, uppercuts, uh, hooks, and then knee again. As you can see it here, very good, Hayden. Keep working, and now again, high kick, and then going to different punches. Very good, Hayden. Again, doing knee. This is my tie slide. Very good. So he goes and punches. Now he moves from side to side. Very good. As you can see it here, good body movement, he keeps going and that's very good. That's what I like about Hayden, fitness is also as a wrestler, he's an active MMA fighter, an active wrestler at the moment, Greco-Roman. You can see that it pays off when you do realistic martial arts, power, fitness, physical conditioning, the first techniques you need to learn in any martial arts. Without that, everything is conceptual and everything is only not realistic very good Hayden. very good well done so we are coming to an end of his session he keeps going punching elbowing thank you very much for visiting my channel please subscribe to my channel